Vata omenta. Two layered folds of peritoneum connecting parts of intestines to posterior abdominal wall. How? Tell me more about omenta. Greater omentum connects the greater curvature of stomach to transverse colon and hangs down like an apron in front of the coils of small intestine. Lesser omentum suspends the abdominal part of esophagus, lesser curvature of stomach, and first half of first part of duodenum from fissure for ligamentum venosum and porta hepatis on the undersurface of the liver. Gastrosplenic omentum connects stomach to hilum of the spleen. What is ligamentum venosum? Obliterated part of ductus venosus. What is the function of ductus venosus in fetus? It shuns greater proportion of oxygenated blood from left umbilical vein to inferior vena cava by passing the liver. What are the anterior relations of stomach? Left lobe of liver, costal margin, diaphragm, greater sac, anterior abdominal wall, left pleura, and left lung. What are the structures that are at risk of being damaged by Perforated gastric ulcer on posterior aspect of the body of stomach. Diaphragm, left kidney, left suprarenal gland, pancreas, transverse mesocolon, splenic flexure of colon, splenic artery. What are the parts of stomach? Fundus, body and pylorus. What are the sphincters of stomach? Cardiac sphincter and pyloric sphincter. What are the mechanisms of cardiac sphincter? Acute angle of entry of esophagus into the stomach produces a valve-like effect. This acute angle is maintained by arrangement of muscle fibers of stomach around cardia and also they act as a sphincter. Mucosal folds at the esophagio-gastric junction act as a valve. Right crust of diaphragm act as pincock to lower esophagus. What are the arteries that supply stomach? Left gastric artery, right gastric artery, short gastric arteries, left gastroepiploic artery, right gastroepiploic artery. What is lesser sac? A potential space that is formed by an extension of peritoneal cavity behind the stomach. Via which it communicates with greater sac. Why epiploic foramen? What forms the anterior wall of epiploic foramen? Free edge of lesser omentum with bile duct, hepatic artery and portal vein. What is the importance of knowing this relation? To compress hepatic artery at anterior wall of epiploic foramen to avoid the bleeding in cholecystectomy. This is called Pringles Manual. What are the other boundaries of epiploic foramen? Posteriorly inferior vena cava, inferiorly first part of the duodenum, superiorly the corded process of the liver. What is ligamentum teres? Obliterated fetal left umbilical vein in the free border of falciform ligament. Then what is formed by obliterated umbilical arteries? Medial umbilical folds. What forms median and lateral umbilical folds? Median umbilical fold is formed by obliterated fetal urethras. Lateral umbilical fold is formed by peritoneal covering of inferior epigastric vessels. Is peritoneal cavity a closed sac? In male, it is a closed sac, but in female, it communicates with exterior via uterine tubes. Does peritoneum cover the liver completely? No, it fully covers liver except bare area of the liver where peritoneum is reflected to diaphragm. 
abdominal esophagus, stomach, duodenum, hepatic flexure of colon, gallbladder, right kidney and right suprarenal gland. What structures are overlapped by the visceral surface of the liver?